guys, welcome to my channel. Diwali is around the corner and in spite of buying sweets from outside, let's prepare some fresh and delicious sweets at home. And today I'm going to tell you an easy recipe for Kesar Malai Peda. So let's get started. So the ingredients we need are about 200 grams of mawa, a quarter tablespoon of saffron soaked in two tablespoon of hot milk, about three by four cup of castor sugar, and lastly, 1 tablespoon of crushed cardamom. Firstly, we will take a pan and put it on medium flame. And then we will add about 200 grams of mawa in it. And we will roast the mawa for about 2-3 to three minutes until it starts releasing little ghee. After roasting for 3 minutes, you can see that the mawa has started releasing ghee and it has all come together. So we will put off the flame and let it cool down for half an hour. After 30 minutes, the mawa has cooled down up to room temperature and has become little tighter. So now we will add about a tablespoon of crushed cardamom in it and we will add small portions of powdered sugar in it and mix. It's important point to remember to add sugar when the mawa is at room temperature. As if you add sugar in cold mawa, it will become crumbly and if you add sugar in hot mawa, it will become like a runny paste. After mixing the sugar well with mawa, we will add the saffron soaked milk in it and mix well. Make sure the milk is also at room temperature. After mixing everything well, we will let it rest in fridge for about 20 minutes. After taking out from the fridge, mix it and bring it together like a dough. Take small portions out and roll them between your palm in round shapes and then press it lightly. Or you can shape them in any other way you want. You can garnish the peda with crushed pistachios and they can last in the refrigerator for 30 days. Now the Kesar Malai peda is ready. So guys, do enjoy these Kesar Malai pedas at home and don't forget to leave your comments below. Thank you guys for watching and do subscribe.